Hi, welcome to my Arch Labs 4.0 uh, system. So um, we are working on uh, one of our goals on the roadmap is to make Arch Labs a rolling release. So a lot of information is um, created on uh, on the ISO. So in in a file in a folder is created somewhere and it's not a package. So if you want to get your Arch Labs 4.0 to the point where it becomes a rolling release and where uh, when when we put something new online, you just do packer update and then you get everything on your system. That's the goal, making uh, this Arch Labs 4.0 uh, a rolling release, waiting for the final ISO to come out. Okay, so um, first off, let's take a look. What has happened? If we take a look at what's uh, online, you see there are two big parts. There's the part from the AUR, and these are the parts from the personal repo. The personal repo is needed when you make an Arch ISO. So in, if you make an, an ISO file, to create Arch Labs, but after that, it's actually not required. We can, of course, update this all the time. So this, that this Arch Labs repo is up to date, up to speed. But I rather wanted it to have on the AUR so that um, we don't need the Arch Labs repo after creation of the ISO. We just change the number, the version of number in AUR, and you're getting the latest. That's better. Better for maintenance, better for you. So we have to get rid of Arch Labs repo. We don't want it anymore. So the best way to do that is actually to go to the file manager, file system, etc. We type pacman.conf, here it is. And then very important, don't open it with Genie, open it with Sublime Text 3, Dev development. You'll see later why make it a little bit bigger so under here this one I want to get rid of it but don't get rid of it just tell them to comment the line toggle comments if possible I don't think he'll do it normally you should do it maybe I've done something wrong anyway hashtag it like so we don't want this repo this is the arch labs repo we don't want it anymore after installation and you'll see in next iso it will be gone it will be there but it will be hashtagged out let's save it with Control s and the password that's why i love this sublime text now we just type our password and it's saved on this specific etc directory so that's that let's again ask for our terminal and see what we get now but first let's do a sudo pacman minus syy and you see here you have four lines so the repo is gone and that's what we wanted if we do packer arch labs it should be a bit smaller so that's the first thing you have to do get rid of all the of the old repo so now you can install everything, but the problem is, let's do number one, zero actually, the first one. If we install it, that's fine. Don't want to read it. It might be that the, the files already exist on that specific place that we want to install it. So that's why some time to time it will not work. In this case, uh, it will work because we have made an extra uh, folder. We wanted to have the the arch labs wallpapers did not have a folder so now they do have a folder so we don't have any conflicts so it's installed let's move this out of the way like so and let's take a look what happens in the user share we have the backgrounds here we now have this file arch labs and the same is in here so the things you see here are also in the folder so we need to get rid of all the rest so right mouse click open folder as root and 
and what we need to do is actually select everything here from here till here and delete all those and well I think we need to change as well some of the links because some of the links will this one for instance the one you were looking at is the black one is the wall 4 um, well it's not linked well it is linked to wall 4 not to arch labs wall 4 because it's in here as well of course but um, we'll have to change the link and the link is in here and if we go to control H and to config and then to auto start no not to auto start we need to go to nitrogen because the file is actually here in nitrogen and it should have here arch labs in between and that will work as well as here as well as here arch labs safe so we're having a, we have a new directory and uh, well we do have it already but we don't point to it again so again here maybe and then we are all set like so okay he he was uh, well, in the next versions, you'll see that the sudo is working fine and the boot, line, boot time from ISO is also fine. So that's fixed. In the meantime, delete and, oops, delete. Like so. So now we have this um, arch labs. First thing has been solved and this nitrogen settings have been saved. Again, it's sometimes easier just to erase everything and wait for the next ISO to come and it will fix all these things for you okay that being said the wallpapers have been done next up is the tent tint 2 if you want to install that one oops no X if we want to install that one, do we have problems? We have problems. There are already uh, in the folder user share tin2, tin2, where is it? Here. Uh, we have music and music and nemesis. So these two have to go. If we delete those two, then everything installs fine. So again, open folder as root. It just, it only takes some, um, well, the first time it takes a long time and then it's quick, but not on next releases, you'll see. That's that, and now we can install it. So that's actually the only thing you have to keep in mind. It's never been packaged in the 4.0, so they're just files. And it wants to write to a specific place and the files already exist and then that this gives a conflict. So we delete the files and we install the AOR package. So Slimlock, Archlocks, Slimlock themes. Slimlock theme is in the Slim, I guess, here, themes. So we need to delete those kind of uh, files but we need to delete this one arch labs well let's have a look uh, what it says there you go it says art labs exists already so we need to get rid of this one so oh sorry open folder as root so this one is gone delete and now we can rerun it it was number two yes no and there you are and here you have the same files but this time with AUR packages so if we add themes you'll have them here as well Baker Arch Labs next one is the bank themes number three yes it's gonna work 
Why is it going to work? Because we're now we can't write to the user's uh, personal folder, so that's not a no do, eh? no can do. So um, we are now writing somewhere else. We're writing here to, I think it was Plank, where is it again? Uh, we always can look Arch Labs Plank themes. Uh, maybe an interesting way to show you guys Arch Labs Plank themes. Double click it, files. And here you see where it go is going to user share plank. So I was thinking, where was it again? I thought it was plank, but I seem to overlook the thing. So here they are. This means this means that control H in the in the local file sh share plank. These themes can go. So these themes are now double. They should be deleted. Okay, back to the user share. Back our Arch Labs. Pipe menus four. This will not work. Quite important. The, those keep. Um, so we have to go to user share user bin. All of the elements with a l a l and dash. And it's gonna say it all it exists, everything exists, so I have to delete everything. So again, we go to open folder as root, let's make it a little bit bigger, and we start with AL Iron Snap. Better check it, it ends here. So from there to there. It's a 26 items, delete. Okay. Let's get rid of that, 26 items. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight more. Let's have a look again. Oh yeah. Here we have also some more. So open folder as root. And don't forget you have here one, two, three, four, five. Well, five more in a way. Six. Those are six, six items. So these have to go as well. Delete. Another one, seven and eight. We found all the AL uh, scripts. And now we can go ahead and install the pipe menus. And you'll see them popping up here to the right. There they are. So here are the conkeys, the, the scripts for the AL. Okay. Pegger, Arch Labs. Next one is Open Box Themes. So number five. Number five. Yes. No. And yes. It's installed, the Arch Labs open box themes. Uh, we gave it a new name, that's why. So user share themes, just type themes. And we've given it the name. We've given it the name. Strange names, I guess. Okay, let's have a look. How do I call it? So, Arch Labs, Open Box, Files. Right, Gulliver, and Logan, and Patrol, and Sindel. 
All right, so four names, and then of course no conflicts, so you can keep all the rest if you want to. But it, it's those ones, so these four can go. So open folder as root. And like I said, it's these ones needed uh, a new name, and we've deleted them. I'm gonna delete them like so, so we have them in uh, the other names. So that's that. What else? Hobby logout teams, number six. And as you can see, it already exists. So we have a problem with that. So we need to go to OP logout, user share themes. Uh, here it is. So open folder as roots at the bottom somewhere here. Delete. It's not going to be lost, my friends. It's going to be installed right now. And watch it pop up underneath here. And there you have the Sadio log logout or this one, these icons. Okay, next up, almost there. So the docs, documentations, well, you won't be needing those though, but um, the chances that they are will, that they will be uh, changed are slim, but possible. So seven. Oops. And it says, look my friend, I can't go there. There is something already there, so I can't copy paste it there. Arch Labs Docs. This one. Let's get rid of yeah of all that. Arch Labs. This one is going to be deleted. Correct. Yep, they are correct. And now we can install the docs. And there you have the docs again. Next up is common git. It wants to install a user lib. User lib. I see this here. Arch labs. Arr lab. So two files, that's correct. Let's open it here, delete it, yes sure, because it's going to be replaced with rates, yes, no, and yes, and there I have Arch Labs again, and the last one, the best one, wow, it's just theming, but theming is fun, that's why I say the best one. It wants to copy paste all the art themes over. The thing is, they are already there. So themes, uh, user share, user share themes. So all the art themes, arc, arc, arc. If I want to install it, you get this. Everything exists already, kind of message so let's get rid of all the arc but not the really arc and the original arc one from Horst but so not, not this one but let's make it easy for ourselves so from there to there except this one and pressing control by the way except this one that one and that one so these are the original from Horst 3180 and these are all mine except this one, this one and all the rest are created or have been created by me 
accept or agree. Agree, agree, and agree. Now we're correct. So, our crimson, crimson, evoke pop, evoke pop, frolly, frolly. There are always three elements as you can see new mix, new mix, dark, new mix, darker. Paper, 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 papyrus, papyrus, polo, polo. Smoke, smoke, takao, takao. Okay, we should get rid of those. And unfortunately, I was not in the open folder as root. So I'll have to select them again. So from art till art darker. This one is an original one. That's an original, that's an original one. And that and that and that is an original one. So all those selected should be deleted. Nope. Not that one and not that one. Okay, that's it. Delete 27 files. Um, yeah, it's possible. Nine teams. Delete. And let's install it again. Nine. Yes. No. So again, please, um, if this is too much, just wait for the next ISO. So this is 4.0 and the next one will have all these packages ready for you on the AOR. So you don't need to do this. It might be interesting for people who want to move up and take the next step, a rolling release already now. And um, well, you have to do some manual work. I'm not intending to write a script to do this. I think it's better you do it with uh, common sense and, and you see what's what you're doing to your machine rather than running a script at this point. Um, now, everything has been installed. So next up, uh, in a few months time, I make a new uh, releases from these elements, from these packages. You just type this one. Of course, we have this little message up here that we should update. I haven't done that. It's a clean installation, but you'll see that there are no arches available here. So once I change anything online and the AOR says there is a version, a later version, then I'll install it and download it. Okay, that's about it. Um, there might be some smaller issues as well, like links. We've, we've dealt with the wallpaper link. Um, tint will be a little bit different. Yeah, tint is a good idea. Let's take it still. Let's quickly take a look if I forgot something. Arch Labs, like the tint is something I forgot. So in the file manager, we have our folder tint too. Uh, we can actually delete these themes. So delete them. Why? Because of the themes being now somewhere else. You change our themes in preferences, tint to GUI. And I'll have to wait a little bit. Voila. So they're no more, no longer inside our personal folder. They're always in the user share tint too. So if you want to take the latest one, the tin 2RC, we can just say, okay, we want to have a look at this one, and there you go. So that's how you can move around, so that's okay, like so. So that's tin 2, that's covered. We should delete that one. Slimlock themes, no issue, I think. Plank themes, we've deleted them. On the local folder, pipe menus is the same. Open box, we've deleted them. All that about, okay. Okay, I think we've uh, covered everything. So now you're up to speed. So now you're actually not on Arch Labs 4.0, by the way. So if you really want to show off and say that I have the latest without having an ISO, you can do so always. You can say, we can say, you can say in here, for instance, that you have the release of one or something similar, like so, and then save it, and then you have changed it. Okay, have fun uh, with this uh, running of rolling release, since if you have done everything now, 
then you will have a rolling release and when we make a new wallpaper or a new theme or anything of these elements here then you get your updates in and you have the latest Arch Labs. Enjoy!